This is actually a really good fit. But you still want a little bit of room so you can actually wiggle your toes. If you're putting that on and uh, your toes right at the front and you can't move it around, that's probably too tight. Okay, so whatever your um, walking shoe is, let's say you walk around like your street shoes are a 10 and a half, you probably want to try on a 10. You want it a little tighter than your street shoes. Because if you're loose in there and your feet are moving around, it's going to be hard for you to cut and accelerate and be quick and have good reactions around the field. Okay, so you want it nice tight, but like I said, I want to be able to wiggle my toes there and I want to feel a bit of space, nothing too much. Okay, so I would usually come and I'd put these uh, boots on. These are actually really nice boots. They're a lot lighter than they used to be. And then make sure you actually try them out. Okay, so first of all, I would just walk around in them, see how they feel. Comfort is huge. You don't want to wear a boot. It's going to be pinching your feet, giving you blisters, even if they look cool. Okay, it's not worth it. Comfort is number one. But I would just walk around and then usually I just try cutting. How does it feel to change direction? Okay, so change direction. Around, maybe get a couple touches. Actually, feel the boot out. Does it feel good when you make that touch on the ball? Okay. I don't really like the synthetics, like this sort of thing. I don't really like that. I don't feel like you get the as good of a touch as you do with the leather. Leather feels way nicer when you're controlling that ball. That's just my personal opinion. Again, don't take my recommendation, take what you think feels best on your foot, gives you the best touch, feels the nicest to wear. I focused on the right fit, so remember if I walk around in like a 10 and a half, then maybe a 10, this is actually a 10 and a half, but it felt right for me. Okay, so if you can try those little half sizes even, trying on those different half sizes may, might make a big difference. The biggest thing is comfort. Like I said, I don't want to be biased. I did catch these, these boots did catch my eye and I did like them. But I didn't want to be biased about that. They have to feel comfortable. They have to feel good, especially when you're cutting, when you're changing direction. You don't want your feet slipping around in there and the touch has to feel good on the ball. So if these boots check all those boxes, then I think they're a good pick for you. Um, and it's also good to try on a couple things because you might be surprised which boot actually feels the most comfortable and which boot you prefer.